What's up friends, it's time for the Monday moment. You knew it. One of the most important moments of your day is when you break the fast, or what we call breakfast. For some of us, you'll do it first thing in the morning. For others, it's like, no, I'm gonna wait till lunchtime. I don't care. Either way, you're breaking the fast. As a raw vegan certified nutritionist, someone who ran an ultra marathon 100% raw, I did, I want to let you know that there are some things that you can do to help your body perform better because it's the most important moment. It's where you start and how you start sets up everything else. So there's a couple of things I want to share with you. Number one, if you find that you're a heavy pasta eater, you like to eat lots of pasta or you're finding unnatural sources of sugar or you're craving carbs, as they say, I want you to start off with fresh fruit. I've got some mangoes here. I typically peel them and just eat them fresh. I got some apples and I, and I know people always talk about how bad sugar is. They don't know what they're talking about because sugar is necessary for the brain and it's necessary for the body. But the goal is to get it through natural fruits and vegetables. Just a side note, I'm just sharing with you as a raw, certified raw vegan nutritionist, ultra marathoner, I'm telling you from my experience, but that doesn't make my experience perfect. That's why I said, if you find that you crave carbs, this is one of the ways that you can prevent absorbing unnatural carbs on a regular basis by giving it God's carbs, which allows you to have the energy to perform and control your desire for the unnatural carbs. Now, the second thing I want you to do is I want you to think about, hmm, is my body alkaline or acidic? Am I feeling queasy? Do I have acid reflux on a regular basis? Am I often super moody and I don't seem to be able to control my moods? Then my friend, you probably want to get yourself plenty of vegetables, right? I know you're thinking, Marquise, that's not breakfast food. Well, friends, that's because you've been programmed, according to marketing, to buy the things they want you to buy called breakfast food. It is what it is. Yesterday morning, I went out with a friend to have brunch. I had pancakes. I don't do that often, and I really enjoyed them. But when I walked in the house, all I wanted to do was rest. I had a sense of I just want to go to sleep. Yeah, those pancakes didn't serve me. I had things I needed to get done. So while my palate enjoyed it, my body told me, yeah, it wasn't so good. Starting your day with some fresh sea sauce, some black cracked pepper that's fresh, along with some avocado and spring mix. Mm, I'm going to feel refreshed. I'm going to feel light. I'm going to be clear headed. I'm going to be ready to take on my day. Trust me. Just try it. Two weeks will change your life. Why would I do that? Because I got things to do and I need my brain functioning for me. One of the things that we are often depleted of in our body is oxygen. Now, that's because of a couple of things. One, we are not hydrated. Water helps carry oxygen throughout our body and helps us hydrate and feel alive. And it's the actual current. It actually moves the current of electricity through us that allows us to feel alive. It's a conduit. The second thing is we're not getting enough fresh foods which contain oxygen and helps it circulate and heal throughout our body. Instead, we get foods that are dead and it shuts us down. Listen, you have this moment every day. Make it count. Peace.